So um, have you seen the latest breakthrough where an AI model actually re-engineered proteins to uh, essentially rejuvenate old cells? Yeah, right. It's like they turned back the aging clock. That's wild. Using GPT-4B micro, right? They um, specialized it for protein engineering for the first time. Exactly. And uh, it was trained on, you know, protein sequences, biological texts, and even 3D protein structure data to come up with variants of those Yamanaka factors that are um, crucial for turning adult cells into stem cells. Mm -hmm, that's incredible. And they uh, achieved a 50-fold increase in stem cell marker expression. That's a huge leap from the typical 0.1% conversion rate, isn't it? Yeah, it's like they turbocharged the efficiency of cellular reprogramming. You could say it's like using a supercharged engine to power up um, your cellular repair system. Uh-huh, I can imagine that. But isn't it still early stage? I mean, lab-based results are promising, but what about scaling it to clinical treatments? That's a fair um, point. The experiment is really a proof of concept. Translating these enhanced proteins from dish experiments to, you know, actual therapies in humans is quite a leap. Yeah, definitely something to keep an eye on. And then there are um, biosecurity concerns too, right? If an AI can design better proteins so quickly, that power could be used for the wrong purposes. Absolutely. The dual-use nature of these tools is a big worry. It's a bit like handing over a super advanced chemistry set, amazing innovation with potential risks. Indeed, risk and reward in perfect balance. Switching gears for a moment, did you catch that aside from the protein engineering news? There's also chatter about AI reaching levels that mimic um, human-like consciousness. Yes, I did. Mustafa Suleiman from DeepMind pointed out that we might be on the brink of seemingly conscious AI. Though I um, find that a bit overstated at times, it's still worth the conversation. Right, though I kind of think it's more a simulation of consciousness rather than true sentience. Yeah, exactly. It's a nuance that we should... Um, critically assess, they warn that the public might be unprepared for the fallout if people start believing these systems are truly sentient. Definitely a topic to watch. And uh, alongside that, there are other tech headlines like innovative drone deliveries by Chipotle. But that's a whole other realm of tech innovation entirely. True, it's like every day there's another leap in how tech is reshaping our world. So in essence, AI isn't just about chatbots anymore. It's diving deep into transforming science and even our daily lives. Precisely. It's uh, an exciting but uncertain frontier where breakthroughs like re-engineering proteins could change regenerative medicine, all while ethical questions and practical challenges remain front and center. Yep, balancing progress with responsibility. I guess the takeaway is that while these experiments are groundbreaking, we need a measured approach. Celebrate the progress, but remain cautious about the risks. Exactly. Um, every step forward comes with new challenges. It's like opening a door to the future. You never quite know what lies behind it until you step through. Right on, and that's why these discussions are so vital. Well, here's to hoping that these leaps in AI will truly benefit humanity while we stay sharp on the risks. Agreed. Cheers to a future of innovation that's both bold and responsible.